Yes, sir! What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Channel. Let me make myself a little bit bigger. Coming to you live with another video, man. Check it out, guys. I'm going to tell y'all the truth. First off, look at what we're going against, man. These guys don't have no garbage records. They, I mean, well, one of them not that good, but that ain't the point. The point is that the, the, the sum total of the team doesn't have a garbage record. We don't have anybody that has shooting bills. Look at what, who I'm playing with. I'm just playing with my homeboys. I am a two-way playmaker, just so you can see. Look, two-way playmaker, right? This is why I'm not worried about anything that these guys are talking about in the 2K that's coming up. Because no matter what happens in the game, I'm going to be able to shoot the basketball. Now, a lot of times, a lot of times we look at stuff like, well, you know, you got to do this, you got to do that. You got to have the T-Rex arms. I'm seeing a whole lot of that. You got to be small. You got to be whatever. Look at that pass. Look at this. Okay, if I didn't get past me the ball, then it would have gone in. But, I mean, it's like a lot of people worried about a whole bunch of the stuff. The one thing that we always do with 2K is we learn how to shoot. We're going to learn how to shoot the basketball. I'm going to learn how to shoot the basketball. I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to figure out what Bill can do what. Who can do this? Who can do that? I'm going to figure out everything that there is to figure out about this game. And that's why I found out like day one or day two or whatever that you can shoot the ball and actually be effective. Oh my God, he got blocked inside. You can actually be effective with a two-way playmaker. I played with this guy. This is like one of the first bills I got over 90. And uh, he, he ends up being a really good player. The only problem is you have no badges to protect you. And that's one thing about 2K that I never cared about. I don't need badges to protect me. Like, yeah, trays up, splash down. Yeah, you can have badges to protect you, and you can have, you know, badges, are, that's, what, that's what they're there to do. They're there to protect you against bad decisions. Like, I got the guy to play defense because I just wanted to be able to shut down point guards and uh, just wreak havoc on the other team, especially when we play pro-am and stuff like that. Give me the steal. When you get the steals, and you can do stuff like that, like, it makes up for me not being able to really shoot the basketball or really be able to score like that. If I can get two or three steals a game, what I was thinking about, if I'm getting two or three steals a game, that more than makes up for my lack of being able to score because we're going to get scores in the uh, in the open court. Now, will that work all the time? Nope, you're not going to be able to rely on that. But I guarantee you that other times I'm going to have people that can shoot the basketball. I'm going to have three-point shooters around me if I play a position like this. And so that's what I'm saying. Like, if you're looking at playing a point guard or if you're looking at making making a scoring guard or whatever, your primary focus, whoo, back though, looking at everybody getting swatted. Your primary focus is not to actually score the basketball. If you can shoot threes, it's a luxury, but you're really looking to be able to create out, create offense by penetrating and uh, doing stuff like that. So I, I just don't know why I have this up here saying why I won't be playing 2K19 uh, because it seems like all the people that get most of the, the love in the 2K community are people that don't even play the game. Look at that mid-range. Cash! Pipe it up, I got the price on reserve. Most of the people, it seems like they don't even play the game. You don't even get no love from playing the game. You just got to report on the game and report the news and do all this stuff like that and just do anything except play the game and you get all the love and the support. So, hey, that's what I'm about to do this year. I'm just about to just report on everything I see. And, uh, and, and you know, gameplay will be secondary because that's what it seems like. But back to this, if you're making guys with T-Rex, should I say rack though? If you're making guys with T-Rex arms or you're making guys with, with small arms and all of this stuff, why are you doing that? Who are you listening to? You're listening to people that don't have the game, haven't played the game yet, and, and we really don't know. Nobody knows anything about the game, and nobody has had any extensive time with the game, with the exception of maybe Chris Move. If Chris Move told you to create somebody with T-Rex arms, I mean, I, I would do that. But this guy right here, I am not afraid to shoot threes with him, and he has, oh, trades up, green bean, money team, splash down. I got a 73 or a 73 three overall. I'm not afraid to shoot with this guy at all. And, and the only thing is that, I know that I know my jump shot. I created a jump shot. And people was people were wondering, like, yo, how are you able to do that? But, hey, it is what it is. But the, the good part, give me that ball. The good part is I got 99 speed. I got, like, 90-some speed with the ball, maybe 80. I don't know what my speed with the ball is. I got a 99 speed, and this guy can quit the game. But the thing is, if you can shoot, you can shoot. If you can't, you can't. If you, had to rely, if you have to rely on bads, and he definitely broke my ankle, but I, I was able to recover. If you have to rely on badges and a rating to make you be a good player, now, I'm not going to say that, that you can. You should be able to just do whatever you want to with with no... And I'm getting bored out here because I got long arms. I'm not saying, ooh, flashy pass, trades up, 
break down. I'm not saying that that you should be able to go out there with a 73-3 like I'm doing and shoot threes. What I'm saying is, if you're a good player, you shouldn't have to rely on the badges to carry you. You shouldn't have to rely on the rating to carry you. You should, be, you should be able to rely on good basketball to carry you. So I'm not gonna sit here and try to look at everything that I can do to get every little advantage. And then when all those fails just left right, like that's, to me, that's, that's, that's not the way that you're supposed to play the game. You're supposed to make a player that's gonna play the game the way that you wanna be able to play. I wanna be able to shoot. This year I wanna be able to shoot and I wanna be able to play defense. So I'm gonna make a defensive, I'm gonna make a two way sharpshooter just like I did this year. At the beginning of the game, I was playing the game. I'm shooting, I'm doing my thing. And uh, by the end of the game, I had what? I was shooting 64% from three. And all of my players are two ways or something like that. So I think I got one play, uh, I think I got one shot creating, right? I think I got one shot creating uh, playmaker and he's like an 86 or something like that. I didn't even play with him because I, I really didn't like playing with him. But the big, the big thing is I can shoot the ball and if you can shoot the ball, you shouldn't be afraid of anything that 2K is going to do. It's going to be a level playing field, so either everybody's going to be able to shoot or nobody's going to be able to shoot. But whatever the case may be, you're going to just have to do what you can do and figure right. You're going to have to figure out what it is that you're good at and what it is that you want to do and what it is that your player is able to do and just make a player according to that. Stop listening to everybody. Stop making guys. Look, give me that steal. Like, stop making people that are five feet tall, you know, you know, six feet tall, six one, six two, with no no defensive nothing, no doggone, oh, right! No defensive nothing, no kind of shit. Like, the T-Rex arms we tried in the 17, dog. The T-Rex arms are not going to save you. We did it in 17, and you're a liability on defense, you're a liability on offense. I mean, uh, uh, as far as getting rebounds and, and finishing at the rim and stuff like that. And it's, it's just not going to work out well for you. You're going to end up spending a lot of money, and you're going to end up doing this again. I'm not saying that T-Rex arms won't be the wave. I'm saying just wait and see. That's all I'm saying. Just like Swante say, let us make the mistakes for you. Let the 2K YouTubers make the mistakes for you. Let me make my bill, and if it's trash, I'm going to tell you it's trash. I'm not going to ride it out. I promise you I won't. I'm not going to try to ride it out to the end and be like, this bill is the truth when this bill is really garbage. Like I said, if I wasn't able, like I just shot perfectly with a two-way playmaker, and I got no shooters on my team. Like, I I, I don't. I had a shot train slashing on my team, and I got, and I had a uh, two-way two-way slasher, so I don't have any shooters. I'm the only person that can even try to shoot the ball. 10 points, five assists, four steals. Like, that's, that's when I'm playing with this guy, that's what I'm looking for to carry the game for me. I'm not looking for, you know, other things to carry the game. But it is what it is, man. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I hope y'all get the gist of what I'm saying. Make a player according to how you want to play. If you really want to play sharpshooter, they're going to give you the opportunity this year. You're not going to be, any, be able to do anything other than shoot the basketball. You're not going to be able to dribble. Uh -oh, well, they say that every year. Who knows? You're not going to be able to dribble. You're not supposed to be fast. You ain't supposed to be able to do none of that. Only thing you're supposed to be able to do is, is shoot the basketball. We don't know how that's going to be. I'm going to be a two-way playmaker. I'll be able to shoot the basketball, and I'll be able to uh, play defense. That's all I'm trying to be able to do anyway. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I don't have anything else to say, really. I don't, I'm not going to make one of these videos put 95 ads on it and then like that because it ain't long enough. If it was, I definitely probably would. Maybe I'm maybe I'm cheating myself. Do y'all want me to just put out videos on it, dumpster dive for news and put out videos on every single thing that come up? Or is everybody else doing that enough and then I just need to leave it alone and let's just put out concrete stuff about the game? I mean, like a lot of people eating off of it. I, get, I would like to eat off of it too. It just don't seem like... I can't put out information that's not confirmed. And so I do got something that I'm going to put out later on today. Um, we'll talk about that. But I just can't put out unconfirmed information or, you know, just speculation. I just don't like to do that, man. That's just not me. Anybody that's doing it, that's eating off of it, salute to you. Get your money. But it, it's just not my thing, man. But I promise you, you will be able to shoot. If you figure it out, you find you a good jump shot, just make the player that you want to make. You will be able to shoot. You will be able to play. If everybody got 79 shooting, Everybody's not going, they, they're not just going to leave it like that to where nobody can shoot the basketball all year. 2K16, you know, 70s was good enough to be able to hit. 2K17, high 70s, low 70s. I had a, uh, I had a 70 uh, three-pointer with my, with my regular playmaker in 2K17 and I could shoot threes. People thought I was a sharp shooter. So the thing is, if you find a shot that you're comfortable with, you can make the player that you want to make and you'll be able to hoop, man. And if you can play, you can play. 
And if you don't, maybe you do need to hide behind those badges and maybe you do need to, to make a player that's going to be a bailout player if you're just not – if you don't plan on getting good at the game or, or learning what your player can and can't do. But it is what it is, man. Do whatever you want to, like Devin the Dude say, do what the fuck you wanna do. Cause that's what you're gonna do anyway. I hope that I see a bunch of T-Rexes out there day one with minimum weight getting blown by and dumped on and not being able to defend my guy who shouldn't be able to do anything. And uh, you know, it is what it is, but I will continue to bring you guys stuff straight from the game, just the actuals and the factuals and the only stuff that's confirmed. And I'm not, I, I can't make a best build video because I don't know what the best build is because nobody's played the game yet, but it is what it is, man. Um, hey, a lot of other people got those videos, so go check those out. Get an idea of what you want, but please don't spend your money until that Monday or Tuesday when the game really comes out and you've heard all the YouTubers complain all weekend and they should be able to tell you what it is that that you should be making or you shouldn't be making or maybe the play sharps can't shoot. T gonna tell you their play sharp is trash by Monday. We'll know. You know what I'm saying? We'll know if shot creating slashes are gonna be the way. We'll know if blow buys are 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 killing people. You know, we're gonna know all of this stuff on Monday. So just wait, man. But I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Hello! 360 out this mug.